Mr. Chris Hill. Stewart in the white shorts, Jones in the black shorts. Let's get it. We have a significant size difference here in build. Yeah, it's interesting to see yeah. the different body types yeah. that can get in there. Stewart obviously super stout. Jones a little lankier, longer. We saw this the last time with Stewart. Got a great takedown and working for one here. Nice entrance from Stewart. Jones doing a good job of hip heisting, getting back to his feet, but Stewart able to floor him once more. That state champion wrestler is coming in, at, into play right now in this bout. Jones is doing a good job, though, of yeah. just springing right back to his feet, being athletic, and we'll see who's able to keep this going. Stewart is very strong. There he is, showing it off. Corey Stewart trying to manhandle Anthony Jones in the early stages of... Jones pops up once again. Let's see as the fight kind of continues, yep. if he's able to just pop up so seamlessly. He's doing a good job fighting the hands. He needs to make sure he's fighting the hand on top rather than fighting both hands at the same time. It'll be hard to separate them that yeah. way. We've got a, we got a, we've had a couple of fence grabs there, too. You need to be, <laughs> be aware of that. I didn't, I didn't hear a warning for him. No, I didn't either. <laughs> <laughs> Stewart working the inside of that leg with the knee. Oh, oh, that's another one, man. Stewart is just compact, strong. He's got his double underhooks. It's going to be difficult for Jones to make any space here. He needs to strike, kind of do what he's doing, but allow his strikes to create space, create opportunities for himself. Yeah, you have someone so, so thick on you, it's, it can be very frustrating, too. Me personally, I've always struggled with shorter guys being a longer fighter. I know, I know that goes against what most people think, but uh, fighting a guy shorter, everything comes from underneath, especially a guy that, that has a wrestling advantage. It seems like they're already underneath you yeah. before anything even happens. So it, it's, it's always been uh, a trickier matchup for me personally. I prefer a taller guy myself. Well, and you also have the, the, you know, once they're mounted or on top of you in any position, they're just so much heavier, you know? Heavy, strong, yes. compact. Those are things that kind of come with this type of build. Stewart fighting out of a triangle here, though. Let's see if Jones can do the necessary things to complete it. He's being he's being talked through it over here by Wayne Knutson. And again, Stewart, like Stewart's got to be careful because he's going to get triangled right yeah, he, there. Yeah, he, he picked him up and he slammed he's got him. It in there. Yeah, this is this That's is it. finished. And look at that. How the tables turn so quickly. Yeah. And, and right there, I hate to say it, but Corey Stewart just focusing on being too physical, trying to pick up, pick him up and slam him, make something happen. But he didn't address the actual submission, thus he got finished. Yeah. How about another triangle choke? How about that. another fight that ends in the first round? I'm not mad at it. You Let's gotta love it. What, what a great turnaround there for Anthony Jones. Corey Stewart dominating the majority of that round. And finally Jones realized, hey, this young man is putting himself uh, in a position to get triangled. Kept working for it and finally gets the submission finish yeah, you, here you, in the round you got to be careful picking guys up yeah. and slamming them and doing all these things. you still got to pay attention to the position you're in. Stewart ultimately just made some mistakes and it cost him. Jones overcomes the early storm from Corey Stewart and turns into the lightning. I'll tell you what, great performance there by Anthony Jones as he strikes at the end of round number one and picks up the victory over Corey Stewart. Those SMAA boys, they're pretty tough, man. Yeah, and you also, when you have a thicker guy, there's less room between that that, that neck and that shoulder, and it, you know, once that thing is in there, it's in there. No, you're, you're absolutely right. That thicker build does make you more susceptible to these blood chokes. And Anthony Jones gets into, gets into his spot, cuts the angle, finds the triangle, gets the finish. Wonderful job. 